When a mutated flytrap tries to eat, all these extra trigger hairs are supposed to help it catch food quicker, seeing as it only needs two of them to be touched before it will close. But as this fly starts to get some nectar, we can see how extra trigger hairs actually makes the plant close before the fly is in the right spot. Yet seeing as it has caught food in the past, there is something we haven't seen yet. You see, flies often just stand still in the middle of a trap waiting for their friends to arrive or to just clean themselves. And seeing as flies only move their paws while doing this, the extra trigger hairs will actually help this plant catch them. However, our plant might be a bit too small for the giant blue flies, which is why I brought out an even smaller plant to show him how it's done. And Crosstooth here is also a mutated flytrap. Send this to a cockroach. 